Welcome to Sports Insights. I'd like to first thank you for becoming a member and also congratulate you for taking um, the first step in becoming a smarter sports better. My name is Daniel Fabrizio. I'm the founder and president of Sports Insights. Uh, in this getting started video, I'm going to give you a very high overview, quick tour of our live odds page and our betting systems. The goal here is to get you immediately um, up to speed and immediately using the Sports Insights product to make better, more informed decisions. So first and foremost, after you log into your account, of course, click on the Launch Sportsbook Insider account. I have a pro access. You might have a different level, but the inside will look the same except for access to certain features. Um, I'll close the tooltip function. You can go through that on your own time. This is really about showing you uh, at a very high level what we can do right now. I'll close the sidebar so we get a better look at the live odds page, and I'll go to the NFL uh, sport since it's the most popular bet sport out of all of them. Uh, I think it's important to know this is exactly how the sports betting industry looks at the sports betting world. Uh, if you go to any sports book, legal or illegal, it, you'll find a service like Sports Insights, in many cases Sports Insights, helping these line makers set their line and follow the action. That's why it's important for also for the betters to understand the tools that they're using and to implement them themselves to base, basically give themselves an edge. It's it's it will help you no matter what team you're going to bet is know why that price is what it is and if is there an opportunity to continue to bet that game the way you liked it and really what's causing that line move to move. Um, at Sports Insights, we do a very good job at tracking all this. We track injury reports at a very high level. If a breaking priority one comes out, we're on top of it. Uh, we also track which way the game's getting bet. We take you behind the lines. You'll see in this Miami uh, Buffalo Bill game, you know, the market right now, 73% of the, the bets coming in are coming in on Buffalo. Uh, also, what the game opened at at Chris and where it is now. It's important to have. Uh, good opening sports books that you're tracking, guys that actually open the number first. Chris is one of them. We, we set up a few of the ones in your default profile, Greek, Pinnacle, Five Dimes. They're very influential in the U.S. market, and you'll find their numbers come out early, and then also when they move, everybody follows, so they're good ones to, to have uh, looking at in real time. Now, the betting percentages is probably one of the more unique things we do at Sports Insights, and uh, uh, really a great way to help find value in in the marketplace. Now you press the info button and that will cl quickly show you how this game is getting bet at e each individual book. In this case the spread is um, in the market 7327 but if you look at how that breaks out you can see from left to right how those books are betting are getting bet at each individual book. So sportsbook.com, you can see it's closer, it's a little over 80-20. Uh, bet US a little bit less than that. Carib is very one lot, one one way action. Wager line's a little more 50-50, uh, as well as five dimes and sports interaction and Chris are more closer to 75-25. So it's it's really interesting that you when you're using this, you know where those numbers come from um, and you have you have confidence. That these are independently owned books um, and you're getting a good sample size. You can see for the number of bets. The line chart is also very important. Um, as you would in the financial world, why would you ever buy stock, say an IBM, if you had no idea what it opened at today or what it was priced at right now or even how it's been trending the last week. Uh, in this case, you can see it over time. You can see the shaded in areas, the betting percentages. They've been pretty one-sided the whole week leading up to this game. But you can see it opened at 1, went all the way back to um, got, bat, got bet to a pick -em, and now is back at 1. Uh, there was an injury alert on this, and we'll see that was Fred Jackson from Buffalo. So this is really a powerful view to see what was going on in this game. So if you did, say, want to take Miami um, already from another you know system, but you could quickly look at, okay, evaluate, okay, well, is there still value in here? Do I still get a good number, and what's causing this number to move where it is today? In this case, overwhelming action on Buffalo. Buffalo's becoming <clears throat> a little bit more of a favorite, which is good. I don't mind dumb money, which is just the public chasing numbers. Um, I'd be more concerned with a um, if the line had moved against the public. Uh, in this case, it looked like it did early. See, they went from minus one all the way back to a pick em, but the public action has come more in on Buffalo counteracting those big bets. So that's a way right off the bat you can use the public betting percentages to clearly see through the data that if everybody's betting on the game this way, why is it becoming a reverse line movement? And that's a way to circle that game and say, great, this is an awesome opportunity here to take Miami at plus one and a half. Maybe you can get a plus two out there if you shop it around. Um, and it's a very powerful view. Now, which sports books to track? I think we went into that. I think the info button is very important. Again, you get to see everything going on, the value meter. 
uh, gives you a good breakdown. It, it's, it's our indicators based over here of which which game that we like uh, and why, or which team that we like. In this case, it's a nice contrarian signal. There really hasn't been any steam moves or big smart money moves. There is some injury that's actually on, more on the uh, Buffalo side, which is... Um, you know, counteracting this a little bit, and it's important to know that these are all mostly dictated by line movement, so these will change up to game time, and really, if you want to know uh, the plays that we're going with, sign up for our best bets, which all pro members are automatically. Uh, that will tell you what games that we actually circle. This is not a best bet. When it goes to 100%, it will be a best bet. We'll go there. I can't tell you until, you know, we send out the play at 11 o'clock on Sundays for the NFL, and then during the weekdays, it's 5.30 for all the sports. And on Saturdays, we send out two sends uh, at 11 o'clock in the morning, and then again at 5 o'clock for all those college games to kind of catch the top and the bottom. Uh, you can also sort so if you're a contrarian player and you want to see, okay, I want to see the most lopsided bet games real quickly together, that's a real powerful thing. You just click on the top, and you could sort back. You can sort back by the game numbers. You can sort by the value meter. Um, it's really a powerful view, and it's something that you should definitely know about, and it will help you make a decision very quickly. Um, the last thing I'll get into is the betting system. I'm going to quickly cross over, over these. Um, the first and foremost is our best bets, which I just talked about. Gave you the times that they come out. Um, these are just our... We pull, we pull from all our systems and tell you these are the best ones. If you just want the answers, here they are. Um, also, the square plays, which are just the top contrarian plays. We track those a little bit differently. Those are just 100% we bet against the public. We just take the most profitable ones and send them your way. Line move plays, that's your steam moves. Those are big line moves heading in one direction versus the other. It's interesting, or it's important to note that we track these by which sportsbook triggered the steam move. And that, to us, is the one that moved first. Um, in this case, it's Chris, and they have a very good record. Um, and you'll see on the live odds page, you know, there's a, there's a record there, but the record you want to be concerned about is, okay, we should be tracking Chris steam moves. Don't go with every steam move. Go with ones from sports books that are uh, that are uh, have a winning record. In this case, anything in green is good. Just follow it. Smart money moves are just the reverse line moves. So the betting lines go against the public. Now, how do you sign up for those things? Pretty easy. Go into your settings. You can also customize your live odds page here. You can change around your sports books, betting percentages, uh, fixed columns, and in this case, the alerts. I want to change my betting system alerts. I want to sign up, make sure I'm getting all these things. In this case, you're already getting, the, for all these sports that you, you can check or uncheck, the best bets. Uh, I want square plays. You can get those emailed to you. You can get them as a pop-up. If you're live, logged into the live odds page, you'll see a pop-up. You can also get an app push alert. We have a free app. You download it. Log into with your Sports Insights, and you'll start getting push alerts sent out to that. And um, those are some of the most important things, I think, to, to, to follow here. I will go back to our uh, main account page. It's very important that you guys know, you know, there's other stuff in the getting started. This is supposed to be just a very quick high-level overview. In-depth stuff about specifically, say, Steam Moves, Smart Money, uh, how to use the betting systems, how to customize your live odds page. You'll get very in-depth stuff in there. This is really about getting you on your feet and having you quickly you know, be able to get a value out of our product. Um, you can also do the billing upgrade, uh, products, help center, and launch your live odds. Uh, Twitter is a great way to follow us. You'll see a lot of good information we'll put out there for, from injury reports to uh, new blog posts or even uh, ask people ask members for questions uh, blog content is a great way also to, to, to stay up on what's going on in the sp sports book world we'll put some great content about different strategies different concepts um, uh, we found a lot of members really like that so I appreciate you guys listening in and um, hope you make the most of your sports insights account please contact us if you would like to do a one-on-one -on -one walkthrough uh, at help at sports insights you can use the help live help button or you can just email us Okay, thank you.